Let us continue our worship as we join our hearts and minds together in prayer. Let us pray. On this beautiful spring morning, we come to you, O God, some to greet you with joy, some seeking comfort and peace, others longing for the pain to stop, sisters and brothers belonging together in community, holding hope for one another, sharing laughter, drying tears, all seeking to be your people. As we move through the moments of our lives, you give us an everlasting confidence that nothing and no one can separate us from divine love. Give us the strength and endurance to make it through the long stretches of the night so we can arrive at the dawning of what you have for us. Give us the courage and wisdom to live intentionally into the void, the patience to stand still long enough, the fortitude to wait at the threshold betwixt and between, the stamina to remain in the emptiness for as long as it takes, Prepare our minds, our bodies, our souls. Then take us to the dawning of the new day, the future before us, our future with hope in it. We pray especially this day for those in the midst of the losses of life, grieving loss of health, loss of life, loss of loved ones, loss of jobs and loss of security, loss of hope, loss of courage, loss of faith. We ask your abiding presence for all seeking peace from violence, peace from pain, peace from mental anguish and despair. We call on your sustaining spirit to come to those who have no homes, no food, no friends, no family, those longing to belong who experience no community, those seeking to lead your children through troubled, anxious times. Save us from our quick, quick fix tendencies, intent on our usual frenetic pace, with no time to wait for spirit to come to us, limited tolerance for anxiety and pain in ourselves and in others, little time to wait in the void, standing at the threshold between what used to be and the possibilities you have for us up ahead on the journey. Teach us to grieve well all of our losses, that we might live well the life shown to us by Jesus, who taught his followers to pray, saying, Our Father, Mother, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy reign come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the reign and the power and the glory forever. Amen. Amen. 